here is definitely another one this is a different style like the one that i did last if you see it very well it's the banana style it's called a banana style if you can see very i hope you can see you can see that some of these are raised and some of these like the raised as in like a bump you can see it as a bump it's the styling of the stitches yeah so like this part is deep this part is all raised and you can see that it forms like a kind of triangle that's why it's called it's called banana style and this is the back of it I'm, i just had the purple so this is the back and if you, you can see this is the side that was raised and this is the side that was flat the side that was flat is like the normal stitches and the style that was raised is like the other kind of stitch that i did so this is what it looks like now at the point to change and close this all off so this is the end hope you can see the bumps here can you see the triangles you see the triangles like those bumps and the bumps actually create uh create different waves like so much waves i hope you can see the triangles better this way so it created that waves look very very plated and waves and wavy and wavy <laughs> It's like, I don't even know, it's like a shell. <laughs> it looks like a shell right now. Like, look, this is what I mean by the shell. Look. This is what I mean by the waves. Very, very wavy. And if I flip it I'm into two like this, it comes like some kind of a shell. Like, honestly. Like look at this. So the pattern that I created just that give that um triangle pattern. Like yeah, it gives that triangle pattern and you see that it's extended. Cause I stopped I stopped the um the banana pattern with the triangle pattern at the yellow. And then the other, the purple are just normal stitches, normal crochet. Well, I'm gonna close it up now because this is the end. But this is really big. No, not big. It's very. How do I describe this? Like, it is very okay here. See, this is like a full circle, and it I folded it into two. But look, if I bring it up, it can still go on. Look, this is what I mean. It's very... Should I say it's very roomy? Roomy? Is that the right word? Yeah. It's not gonna fit me, so I don't even think I can try it on. But yeah, the pattern that I created gave it so much more space and it become like this. I'm gonna close it up now. It's curving up. I gotta love the pleats. The pleats. So I finished two crochet during my day, um, for my sister and then for my mates and this is for my other niece. Like this is this is like really really it's for a baby, so that's why it's really small. But look at all this beautiful pleatings around it. Look at all the pleatings. It's this design that I did. The design is um banana. Or they call it triangle. See, it's, a, it's like two kind of stitches. There's the normal stitches, and then there's the other 
not the not normal one that I used to make the triangles or the bananas. And so yeah. And then if I I do it this way, the where it's got kind of folds, that's where the triangle is. Or that's where the banana is. And the yellow parts are the where I actually do all the triangles or the bananas and then the rest the purple are just normal stitches except the first spire here that is also normal but the other ones are just like the not no the not normal stitches with the normal stitches i hope you get it like it's actually quite very nice i'm doing this for my babyness and i hope she likes it like it's quite big right now because I can't even, I mean, I shouldn't be able to wear it because it's not my size. Like it's curved, but it's not curved enough yet to like keep it stable on the head. I'm trying. I'm trying not to make it too tight so I'm being really really careful so it's not too tight so it's just exactly and like you won't leave her marks like all around her forehead I hope she likes it wait on wait it's my babyness we won't know if she likes it or not but I'm trying not to make it too tight so it won't it won't be inconvenient her and it won't leave marks on her forehead because that's not that won't be good i'm just doing the last stitches all around the edges so it comes full and as a cap hope i finish tonight i want to be able to finish tonight do you think i can finish tonight I think I can finish that. Because I'm done, I'm just like closing it up so it's calm as a full cap. I don't have. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. If you wanna see how I'm doing it, I don't know if you can see it. I'm kind of like skipping a hole, like I said, because it's very wide. So I'm skipping the hole so I can reduce the circumference. It's actually quite a work. It's a lot of work. Crocheting or like knitting. It's a lot of work. Like I'm telling you. And I just like the pleatings here. Like, share, comment. Yeah. You know, I did this during Ramadan and I was like, if anybody wants, they can DM me or comment and say that they want and I'll make one and send it to them. The offer is still open. I mean, like. Anyway, salam alaikum. Oh, hello. My handiwork for my niece. I hope it's. I mean, I measure. I got the measurements. It's. It's very full. That's going to give her some comfort. I hope it gives her some comfort. So this is what it looks like. The waves are from the triangles. The waves, all the pieces. It's very beautiful. I like it. Oh, where's my? Look at my face. My face is so, so. Let me hold. I think I should be able to dab something so like the sheen or the oiliness. Like, or maybe this is for my shea butter, cause. I really like shea butter. Like shea butter does something to you. Like really, you need to put shea butter in your like beauty kit or whatever moisturizer, 
like it's a good moisturizer it's it's good for here too it moisturizes here so or did that work maybe i need to add powder i think this should work i just want the the oiliness to go down a little bit it's actually very it looks like But maybe it's just me looking at it that way. Maybe it's not actually that well. Does it help? Mm, does it help? I feel like that is too bright. The lights in. Oh, now this is too bright. Now this. I like this, and I like this too, it's not too much. I just reduce the shine, but I don't think I can get rid of that. I don't think I can get rid of that. It looks like I can't. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish this real quick. Actually, I, fi I finished. I finished, that's why I'm showing you. I finished. It took me a while because I think I started I started three days before the Ramadan end. Yeah, I started three days before the Ramadan ends. And because after this, I'm going to make one for my sisters. I already make I already made one for my older sister. I'm going to make one for my sisters and my older siblings too. And my dad too. And my mom. I'm going to make one for everybody. I'm going to make one for myself too. I probably would just make like a net for myself. Like a bonnet net. A bonnet. A bonnet net. <laughs> yeah, I'll probably make something like that. I've never done this to receive money from it. As in like I've never done it to to make money. Like I, I've always done it just to give it out. I don't know, if I have followings, like if I have followers, I might, it might be something that I would do, be like, see, if you, like a giveaway, yeah, like a giveaway, something like that. So, like, I'm looking forward to, like, when I grow this channel or when I get some engagements, be like, say, like giveaway, something like that. I want to be something that I do and I just give out. Like, I look forward to doing this one day, inshallah, that I'll be able to do it and just give it out to people at no cost at all. I look forward, like, I really want to, because it's just like a, I guess you can call it some kind of work of art, talent that I catch on, and I like to share it on a different Maybe I would like to for people to benefit from it, my family and whatnot. Like I'm, j I finished it, so I'm just tying the end. If you like, I'm just tying the end. Like I'm crocheting it in the way that I'm. Every time I crochet it, I bring out the this thread, so in a knot, so it makes a knot. Because it's the end, so I want to secure it. All I'm hoping for now that it fits her and that she'll grow to it. I mean, she's a baby now, so hopefully, like when she grows up and like she wants me to, I can make another one for her, or I can open this one. You know, this pattern, I can expand it, make more spirals or circle, and so it can expand and it can be a lot bigger than what's it right now okay we are now at the very end i'm going to make um just a few more knots maybe like two or three depending on how far it can go it can go so yeah 
probably like maybe just three or two. Maybe three. Yeah, three should be three should do it. Three should do it. Even maybe four. Let's do. Let's do one more. <laughs> it's so short. I'm trying to make it work. Yeah, just one last one. Come on. Yay, and finally done. And voila, that's the end of it. Yeah, it makes a good fun. I can't try it on because it's definitely not my size. It's a baby size. I feel like it's going to expand as the more like she wore it. It's gonna like give her room. And I hope it's loose. I made it loose so it won't like stress her and she won't like it won't be so tight. But it's not living so much here if it's too tight. But yeah, it's going to stretch out stretch a little so it's good it doesn't stress her but yeah that's my handiwork and this is it let's see this is the back of it you can still see the pleats in there and you can even cut this out it's too long actually I'm gonna cut it out Yeah. Okay, that's the inner part. Hope you can see through. Can you see through now? Okay, there. You know where it has like these bumps? That's the special stitches. And that's how it has the pineapple. I don't know if you can, if you look closely, you see that that triangle there you see that you see that you see that I'm trying to block the light so you can see what i'm talking about that part right there at the triangle like one two three four five six that's how much i made this stitches like that made the stitches like that to give that triangle shape then if you open it to this side you see that you have that too. like if you stretch this out you start seeing the way that bump where it's where the stitch is raised that's where the triangles are like one two three four five six yeah. and it goes on around like that And that's how the folds happen. If I made it bigger, the folds might not be this clustered together. But because of, I mean, it's really, the folds are really, like, really clustered. And, yeah. Now, I just hope that it fits her. Or if it doesn't, then she's going to grow into it. Like, honestly, when I grow this channel, or, I don't know, if somebody is watching out there, I will definitely like one. You know what to do. You can definitely ask, and at no cost, really. I had, I have so many, so many colors. Yeah. I just feel so proud of this. Like it's a different style. It's not like the normal ones that I should. Now I'm going to start on my sisters. Or maybe I can actually start now and then. You see, she says she wants pink, so we're gonna do pink for her. I wanna mix pink with um, 
the black hood. Like I will do it like this one, but differently, different style. This one takes a lot of time. My dark and stuff, the banana style. It's like a lot of calculations. Like, because you have to get the numbers right to make the shape. So it takes a lot of time like that. So we're going to start with pink. I'm trying to find where the starting is. Come on. Usually, it's usually very clear. Hmm. Can you find the starting piece? No? Where does it start? Okay. We're gonna go like this and see which... <laughs> I'm trying to pull it out to see maybe it's somewhere here. Usually very good. Just right there. Usually how I start this, you roll it, you like make a loop on your finger. And then you start. And then you continue with that till you do the loop. Hold on, I'm going to start that again. Why is it like that? And then you just go around, keep going around like that. I'm I'm on, I'm honestly contemplating to do like the banana style for her, or just like this other beautiful style that I did for my other sister. I'm, I'm really contemplating because and I need not to waste time because if I'm going to be doing this pattern as style I have to start right away on the second spiral so this decision decisions I can I need to make my decisions like in about a minute yeah I'm trying not to make it too full, so especially for her, it's a bigger shape. She's older, so obviously her head is bigger. So I'm trying not to make it too full, because the more full this beginning part is, the more work. Because then, if it's more full, then you have to go more. Uh, more stitches or so more crochet stitches crochet stitches each each circle or each circumference or each spiral so I feel like it would be better if it's not too full so it make my work easier not that I don't want to like make it really nice for her but like look We're going to make, be making this banana style. Yeah, maybe I can make her the banana style, and then I make another one with the other beautiful style. Like really, like there are so many crochet stitches, like beautiful stitches. I'm also still learning, but I like to do it in my leisure time, especially when I got nothing else. <laughs> Thank you. 
there you have it, first spiral done. And then the second spiral is done. Can you see the second spiral? I'll continue this. I'm doing this. I resorted to doing the triangles. And yeah. Triangle or banana style. Anyways. Mm. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Yeah. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Join this platform. Help me grow this. Anyway, salam alaikum.